Hi everyone, in this video we will be connecting our VMware to GNS3 so we can use it to configure networks and do our, base, our basic network practice. Mm. This is our mission, this is the topology with which we will end up with. I have three computers set up on VMware right now. This is a Kali Linux machine, this is a CentOS, and this is a Windows 7 computer. So our end, our end mission is to have all these three computers interconnected and so they can ping each other. Uh, later on with later videos we will connect another network here and use a routing protocol so both networks can computer. We will also hook it up to the internet so all these computers will be connected to the internet all in GNS3. Uh, so let's get started. This first part of the video will be basically just to connect the VMware to GNS3 so we can have our devices interconnected. Um, to do that, we have our VMware opened up and if you look right here, the network adapter it's using is NAT, meaning it is using the same network address as my home computer and it's sharing the same internet connection with my computer. So what we are trying to do right now is to give them a single host adapter so they don't share the same host adapter like my computer right here. To do that we will go to, we will go to edit and virtual network editor. I'll take yes for that. And right here you see these are the defaults which come in with VMware. There is a bridge, there is a host only, there is a NAT. Now the bridge, well it works with it's auto bridging which works with your host adapter. The VMNet one is a host only adapter, but right now it's using DSCP and we're gonna deactivate that. And the next one is the NAT, which is network address translation. Okay. This one right here, what we're gonna do is we will uncheck this. First let me open up my network sharing center. Okay, right here, these are the network cards which I have. So, I'll just go ahead and uncheck that so that it does not have to automatically assign an IP address to VMNet1 and I'll apply it. Okay. So we will add another one because we have three computers. The next one is going to be VMNet2. And we deactivate DHCP. Another one, VMNet3. We deactivate DHCP. Okay. Right here, I'll pull this up so we can as it's gonna add you will see how the network cards will automatically add up if you see right here it's adding up the new network adapters which we just connected so there is VMNet1, VMNet2, VMNet3 and according to our topology that is exactly what we want we will be connecting these three networks in GNS3 and using the VMware to do our testing. Mm. If we pull up GNS3 right now and pull bring up a host, it's not gonna appear. For some weird reason, you have to restart your computer before they all appear on GNS3. So right here, if we pull up our list of network adapters, the new adapters which we created will not be here right now. So what I will do is I will go ahead and stop this video and in the next video, I will restart the computer and we will put up our devices and set up our IP addresses and start pinging each one to the other one. I hope you enjoyed this video and I would like to thank you for watching. Bye.